Advent 1, Wednesday, the Lord is with his church. For God is my king from of old, working salvation in the midst of the earth. Psalm 74, verse 12. Dear Redeemed, the Son of God, who is the eternal King of glory, does not remain apart from his people. The Christ is present everywhere, and he is graciously present with his people. That is his promise, for he has said, I will never leave you, the singular, nor forsake you. Hebrews 13, 5. The Christ comes to be the Savior of the world and to deliver his chosen people, which is another name for his church. Everyone in whom the Holy Spirit has bestowed the gift of faith in Christ through the word of the gospel is a member of the church. The King of Kings comes to deliver his people, whether it is one or two, as in the case of Adam and Eve, or a nation of a million, as in the case of the Hebrew people held in the chains of slavery. God does not do this from a distance. Rather, as the psalmist says, For God is my king from of old, working salvation in the midst of the earth. Deliverance by the Son of God is accomplished in this world, on this earth. To deliver his church of eight on Noah's ark, he flooded the entire world. He stayed Pharaoh's chariots, horses, and riders, and provided the way of escape through the Red Sea for his people. Jesus defeated Satan in the wilderness, stilled the storm on the sea, suffered and died on a cross for the salvation of the world, and defeated death by rising from the dead. Jesus has done this for you. He has defeated the devil for you. He died for you. He rose again from the dead for you. He has delivered you from this land of bondage. You are now on your exodus journey to the promised land, which is heaven. Though the times may be difficult and the tears flow so easily and bitterly, though there is pain of body and soul, though you walk through the valley of the shadow of death, the Lord is with you. Prayer O my dear Lord Jesus, who fills heaven and earth and all creation, I thank you that, according to your word of promise, wherever I am, you are with me. I confess that this truth causes old Adam fear, when I have sinned and fallen short of your law, or when I am troubled or doubting. Send your Holy Spirit to give me the gift of repentance, not only to be sorry for my sin, but also to look to you for the forgiveness that you have accomplished for me. Then may I be comforted by the truth that you are with me. Grant me faith to say with the church that you are my King from of old, working salvation in the midst of the earth. Amen. Hymn 131, stanzas 1 and 4. Jesus came, the heavens adoring, came with peace from realms on high. Jesus came for man's redemption, lowly came on earth to die. Alleluia, alleluia, came in deep humility. Jesus comes in joy and sorrow, shares alike our hopes and fears. Jesus comes whate'er befalls us, glads our hearts and dries our tears. Alleluia, alleluia, cheering even our failing years.